Hi everyone, it's Miss Newman and I am here in a brand new year. Happy New Year everybody um, with our January IB attribute of the month. And this month the IB attribute that we're going to be uh, hearing a story about is principled. And to be principled means to act out of a sense of what is right and fair and just. It means that we bring um, respect for the dignity of the people that we come across and the communities that we interact with. Um, hopefully throughout this month, I want you to think about what you believe is right and fair and just and the way that we all can promote dignity in our community, um, especially when it's hard. So the story that we're going to be listening to today is called We Are Water Protectors. And um, it is about, it's a true story and it's happening even as we speak. And it is a, um, a celebration of the Native Americans who have been protecting the water and the environment for all of us. Um, so here goes. We are water protectors, and it's written by Carol Lindstrom and Michaela Good. We are water protectors. Water is the first medicine, Nukomis told me. We come from water. It, is, it nourished us inside our mother's body as it nourishes us here on Mother Earth. Water is sacred, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. The river's rhythm runs through my veins, runs through my people's veins. My people talk of a black snake that will destroy the land. Spoil the water, poison plants and animals, wreck everything in its path. When my people first spoke of the black snake, they foretold that it wouldn't come for many, many years. Now the black snake is here. Its venom burns the land, courses through the water, making it unfit to drink. Take courage. I must keep the black snake away from my village's water. I must rally my people together. To stand for the water, to stand for the land, to stand as one against the black snake. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. It will not be easy. We fight for those who cannot fight for themselves, the winged ones, the crawling ones, the four-legged, the two-legged, the plants, trees, rivers, lakes, the earth. We are all related. Tears like waterfalls stream down tracks down my face, tracks down my people's faces. Water has its own spirit, Nokomis told me. Water is alive. Water remembers our ancestors who came before us, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. We are stewards of the earth. Our spirits have not been broken. We are water protectors. We stand. The black snake is in for the fight of its life. And that's the end. And there's a, um, a uh, pledge you can take to be a water protector as well. I hope you enjoyed this book. <laughs>